All right, folks, we are here inside a Bass Pro Shop in the Marine section, and um, we're gonna make this a short and quick video, but this is gonna be kind of like a reminder for all my anglers out there. This is like the things we don't think about on a day-to-day. -day. Of course, we got our rods, our reels, all the important stuff, right? But these are things we don't think about that we need, that we actually really, really need. One of them situations where, you know, you break down and you ain't got no tow rope. Now you're in trouble, right? A little simple stuff like that. I'm gonna do a quick walkthrough grab some things from my personal boat, and then just talk to you guys about, again, the simple things you need. Let's rock. All right, stop number one. You gotta have a good dock rope, right? So this is good to tie yourself off. Of course, if the power poles don't reach, it's too deep, whatever, you can tie your boat off. But not only that, if you break down and you need a tow, this is really good to have. This is a 15 foot, I would say minimal 15 foot, but they should have it in longer lengths, 20, 25, something like that. Uh, this, this might save you one day. You got your own special mix, huh? Huh? You got your own special mix. Hell yeah, hey. You gonna give up a secret or what? Like what? I ain't got no secrets on anything. Your, your special mix. We talking, oh, as far as wiping the boat off? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 I definitely gonna get that. I, I gave it up already on, on oh, did Instagram, you? yeah. The vinegar? The vinegar and water, man. 50-50 mix, man, save you a million dollars. All right, so. A little small waterproof case, something like this, to keep your keys, cell phone, things that need to stay dry. Very important stuff. You gotta have a little dry box. Definitely recommend getting one of these. All right, so I'm gonna say this is probably the number one most forgot item in a boat, a throw cushion. Not only will this save your life, this will also prevent you from getting the fattest ticket <laughs> in the United States of America if you don't have one of these. You cannot be on the water without a throw cushion. A lot on, of people forget. On top. On top. It needs to be not underneath. You can't have a whole bunch of stuff on top of it. This bad boy got to be at the very top when he opens that compartment. Otherwise, you're getting popped. I thought I told y'all. I told y'all that before. In case y'all wasn't listening the first time. <laughs> throw cushion. All right, guys. So I feel like everybody knows this, but I'm on social media a lot, and I see a lot of people not wearing this. So I'm gonna say this. And, and I've been there too, so I'm not trying to judge. I have been out there and I forgot to put my life jacket on, but this is probably the most important thing you can get is a life jacket, okay? And if you bring in people out there, you got your, your, your friends coming out, you bringing out children, you guys make sure you got a life jacket for them. And so this is just something else to make sure you got. And uh, this time of year, it's holiday season. So for all my, my wives out there, you're looking to get your husband something, your boyfriend something, I mean, we need stuff like this, believe it or not. We need throw cushions, we need life jackets, little simple things like that. We don't think about it. We, tr we too busy trying to reel one in. So we forget these things sometimes, but they're very important. A life jacket, man, gotta have it. So throwing him on the list too. You cannot be out on the water without a good pair of cutters. I really like to have some side cutters. And then I really like to have a good pair of needle nose pliers, something like this. It really don't matter the brand, but uh, Needle nose pliers, for sure. Some good cutters, for sure. And some, a good set of side cutters. That ain't really a good one. Here we go. Something like this right here. So that way, you can get the fish out of a hook. You can cut your braid. You can cut the hook to get the hook out of you. You need these. <laughs> Trust me, these three right here, gotta have in a boat. You sold your boat back to Bass Pro? Hey, low key, look. They saw they, they saw my boat look so good and they was like, damn, we gotta get one just like Mark's. And they did. I mean, literally the same boat, except for mine didn't have this this blue check and then the blue finish on the on the trailer, but everything else is the same. Everything. Everything. Same seat. Same seat. Same console. Everything, dude. It's crazy. Huh. It's a good looking boat. Yeah. I can't lie. All right, guys, we got what we needed for the most part. And this was just, just a little friendly reminder. You know, these are things that I always forget. So I know other people forget them too, but uh, don't get caught this holiday season or any season really without these items. And like I said, these make great little little Christmas gifts, little stocking stuff or situations. Cause we don't, we always forget these sort of things, man. You get out on the lake, you catch that fish, he's hooked deep with a crankbait or something, and then you're like, dang, I ain't got no needle on those pliers. Happens to me all the time. So these are just a few things that I like to keep in the boat at all times so I don't have a rough day out on the water. So just wanted to give you guys a little quick little reminder.
But uh, we'll see you guys out on the lake. I appreciate everything you guys do. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, follow the channel, all that good stuff, man. Drop me a comment, and I'll catch y'all on the next video.